friends in this video we are going to discuss uh, on the topic of avl tree and here we will learn the types of rotations and how to balance the the tree after uh, insertion of each element okay so first of all what we have done like what is a rotations there are four types of rotations ll rotation rr rotation lr rotation and rl rl rotation like this is left left right right left right right left okay so if there is any unbalanced tree is there right then only we can use the rotation to be balanced okay first of all see what i am telling here i have taken one tree what is this this is one tree okay so in this tree uh, uh, <clears throat> this is the root element this is the root element the left side of root element is always smaller and the right side of uh, root element uh, is bigger sorry let me write is 40 it is greater than the root element okay now it is balanced okay so before uh, you learn about the balancing the first thing you have to learn is like balance factor balance factor equal to height of left subtree minus height of right subtree see balance factor equal to height of left subtree minus height of right subtree okay you should know the balance factor equal to height of left subtree minus height of right subtree so you you may have doubt what is balance factor what is height of left left tree left subtree height of right subtree how to find these values so for that let us take a one example tree okay see here i have 30 10 5 and here and here 2 okay and also here 40 80 and 100 so what is the balance factor of this element is height of left left subtree okay what is it height of left subtree matlab see the left side elements what how many elements are there see excluding this root 1 2 3 3 minus right of right sub right subtree 1 2 3 how many it is 3 equal to 0 okay so balance factor is 0 okay and here what are the elements 2 like how many uh, left side subtree are there for 10 if 10 is the root there are 2 left subtree and minus 0 okay and here uh, 1 minus 0 and here it is 0 and if you see this right so how many elements are there in right side 2 and left side nothing right 0 minus 2 equal to minus 2 and for this 2 uh, 0 minus 1 equal to minus 1 and it is 0 so this is the way to find balance factors okay so after finding balance factor how can we balance the subtree and how can we know when to balance the subtree is nothing uh, balance is the tree is like uh, for that what we have to do so for balance factor what are the values of the balance factor see for balance factor we can say that this root is balanced when when bl like bf is equal to ls minus rs right left subtree minus right subtree is having the values in between minus 0 0 and 1 if balance like if the root has the balance factor minus 1 0 or 1 then we can say it is a balanced root, uh, balanced tree but here we can say uh, it has balanced or unbalanced it is 2 right so we can say it unbalanced and here it is unbalanced so what are these balanced 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 so here like this we can say any root is balanced or unbalanced so what to do with that so if we find an unbalanced okay if we find an unbalanced so what we have to do we have to turn it as balanced so for that what we have to use we will use rotations here left left rotation right right uh, rotations left right left right rotations and right left rotations okay these are the four rotations we will be using in our next next step so you got to know what is balance factor up to now what you are know like what is balance factor how to find the and we have known the formulas okay
so uh, these will the, these are the values right if minus 1 0 and 1 is there for uh, balance factor we can say that like uh, it is balanced so uh, after getting the values more than 1 or less than minus 1 we can say it is unbalanced okay we got to know we got to know whether a root is balanced or not okay done so now let us know what is meant by rotations and when uh, we have to use rotations and how to draw a balanced tree okay so let us go to this topic okay left left rotation so for that what i am doing is see i am taking three elements okay 40 30 and 20 see if you can see you know right how to find the balance factor how to find the balance factor here it has two right two left left subtree minus how many zero right subtree and it will be two and for this one and for this zero right so two it is a what it is a unbalanced factor Matlab, it is not a balanced one so we have to do balanced factor so how many elements are there to the uh, root left there are two left right left and for this it is left so left left unbalanced it is left 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 unbalanced so for left left unbalanced we will use left left rotation ll rotation nothing but rotation means just turning so if you put a nail here right see here like this we will rotate so what it will become the 30 become middle and 40 will be right side and 20 will be left side okay so here if you see the root right root value here left is 1 and right is uh, 1 so 1 minus 1 is 0 0 0 so it is balanced now okay uh, you got to know what is ll rotation right so let us do it right rr rotation similarly if i take 30 40 50 same here it is 0 left here 0 and right has 2 0 minus 2 is minus 2 and for right it has uh, left there is no element in left and it has right for 1 0 minus 1 equal to minus 1 and it is 0 see 0 is balanced factor minus 1 is balanced factor but minus 2 is not balanced factor so we can say it is not a balanced tree so for to convert it into balanced tree what we have to do see here what it has like for the root which is unbalanced what it is having to right 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 and right so here right right unbalanced right the tree is right right unbalanced so for this we will use rr rotation rr means this side we will do rr rotation just turn like this so 40 will be at the middle and 30 will be at the left and 50 will be gone right side 40 will be at the middle 30 and 50 so you got to know rl and rr so let us take another example here i have written 30 and here i have written 10 and here I have written right side 5 ok 3 elements I have taken ok so if you check again for left side it has 2 the left subtree value height of left subtree is 2 minus height of right subtree is 0 is equal to 2 and it is minus 1 and it is 0 ok again it is 2 balance factor is 2 that means 30 is unbalanced for doing ba for doing balance what we have to use we have to check whether what type of unbalance it is left right so it is left right unbalanced so we will use lr rotation left right rotation okay so for that what we will do first we will rotate this one that means 5 sorry it is 15 not 5 because it, uh, right side there will be greater elements right uh, so it is 15 10 is greater than uh, 15 is greater than 10 right we have written like that 15 so first it will be go to 15 so see this will be 15 10 and it will be 30 right now what we have to do again we have to turn this so after turning this 15 will become root and 30 will be at the right side and 10 will be at left side so it is called LR rotation. Now we will learn RL rotation. What we will run? We will learn RL rotation. So for that 
let me take a root as 20 and let me take as 30 and take my life uh, like 25 see 30 is greater than 20 so it is right side uh, and 25 is less than 30 so it is in left side so if you check the balance factor here left side 0 minus height of right subtree is 1 2 2 that is equal to minus 2 and here for 30 left side has one element and right side no so 1 minus 0 equal to 1 okay so it is unbalanced so what type of unbalanced it is right see right and left rl unbalanced it is so we will use what we will use here rl rotation so what we have to do for rl rotation first we have to do this one and after that we have to do this one so after doing this one what will get 20 25 30 so after doing that 25 will become the root 20 will be at the left side and 30 will be the right side okay this is the thing i want to tell in avl trace so you learn how to balance the trees okay by using the rotations okay you got to know right if you have any doubts you can uh, post in the sections so after posting the section if i have time i will make the uh, video on uh, the comments that, that i got okay so you got to know what are the rotations means and uh, how, how we will use the rotations for balancing the tree okay so let us take an example let me insert each element one by one and after that let me balance it okay so i have the elements right 30 10 20 50 and 70 so i have these elements okay so what i will do now so i will insert one by one so i have written 30 first okay 10 is 10 is in left side okay like less than 30 right so i have written left side 20 again that 20 is less than 30 but greater than 10 so it is 20 so if you can see here see here it has uh, 2 minus 0 equal to 2 balance factor and here for this 0 minus 1 into minus 1 and it is 0 balance factor so it is unbalanced first we have to turn this into balance and after that we will add the elements okay for uh, which rotation we will use here we will use left right all r rotation so i can tell you one step simply like uh, for lr rotation and rl rotation we can diet convert into last element and root element see this one we can change like this just take this element into root and take this element to this point position okay then what it will be root will be the 20 and 30 will be at the right side and 10 will be at the left side just dot the lines and change the position okay you got it this is lr rotation okay now done what is next 50 so 20 like 20 is less than 50 right so 50 is greater than 20 and 30 is also less than 50 right so i am writing this on the right side so if you can see left side 1 right side 2 minus 1 okay it is also cool but next 70 we have 20 10 so 70 is less uh, 70 is greater than 30 and greater than 50 so you will write at this place 70 okay but if we calculate the ba balance factor of 20 it is 1 minus 3 is minus 2 and here it is 0 and here it is and here it is uh, left there is nothing 0 minus 2 equal to minus 2 and here it is 0 minus 1 equal to minus 1 and it is 0 see you can ask we have two unbalanced one right we have two unbalanced factors so which one we have to do first if you ask me so i can tell you one thing so here it is 0 right this side it is unbalanced right so sets the last element what is the last element is 70 so while coming back side what is the first unbalanced factor 30 right so first only focus on these one okay factor focus on this one only okay so it is a right right unbalanced for right right unbalanced what we have to do what we have to do we have to use rr rotation like this okay so after doing rr rotation 10 10 20 and 10 will be same but 50 will become the middle one and left side is 30 and right side is 70 so if you can see it is a balanced one how 1 minus 2 minus 1 0 1 minus 1 0 0 like this so it is a balance factor right it is a balance factor right okay like this we can insert any anything okay 
insert insertion of elements by using a balance factor and rotations. Okay.